Hello everybody and welcome to Shen Plays. I know I ended the list last episode saying I was going to the bathroom and I did. And I came back and I realized we had passed a half hour of recording so I figured might as well end the episode there and just start a new episode because 30 minutes is a long time to watch. Especially if you're just in a time crunch between doing whatever you gotta do in the day. Anyway. Came back and I noticed that the uh, people over here had changed their color from green to red. So I was like, what's going on? Well, apparently, they have taken the Kingdom of Burgundy as their primary title. Well, Sultan of Burgundy now. So good for them. There's a kingdom over here now rather than, or a Sultanate over here rather than just an Emir. That's pretty cool. The Muslim Sultanate of Burgundy. And they also have parts of Spain and France. Anyway, back to the war. Maybe I should just use boats to get them down here sooner. This is taking too long. Who is this? There's a lot of Muslims over here. Oh, whatever. Okay, so they have attacked us. Oh, I didn't even notice they were coming over. Alright. You guys stay on the boats. We'll swing you around this way. You guys come this way. You guys finish that siege quickly and then we'll bring you over as well. Seventeenth of March, twenty second of March, perfect. Good, the Pope likes us more. You guys are now running to Apulia. Interesting. This is such a weird situation here. Hurry up and get off the boat. There we go. So we have backup has arrived. And these guys are coming to attack us in Apulia. I'm thinking we should just let them. Then we can pick up this army and swing it around there. 26th of March, 21st of March. Yeah, let's just chill, because we have hills here. Yeah, we have hills. We'll just chill. Alright, you guys. Is that going to be enough boats? 63 and 55. That's 11. No, it's not enough boats. Some more boats. Oh man, that's a lot of boats. Wow. Alright, this battle's almost over. Killed 4,500 of them. Excellent. I know we lost our siege progress there, but I'm okay with it. I want to get over here and let them attack us, and then we'll dump on their head. There we go. Like that. Bam. Just a slaughter. Killed 8,400 of them. Wow. Just finished sieging this shit.
Alright, you're running to Foggia. We'll follow. But we'll take our smaller army and we'll go this way. Eighty-six percent. You want peace yet? Yes. Okay, so we're gonna take over Salerno now. Very nice. Kill some more of their troops on the way, though. That army's toast. Let's go over here. Disband. No. Come over here. All right, excellent, 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 excellent. Taking over the Duchy of Salerno. Let's give those provinces away to some happy Italians. Marshal of Capua, you're an heir though. Court Chaplain of Genoa. You're not heir to shit though, good. You're gonna get the County of Salerno. Now, he owns everything in this county now, but he will give these two away to somebody. Let's find somebody else. Chancellor of Cremona. You're not heir to anything. You have no relatives. Perfect. Toronto is yours. No, not city. County. County. Bingo. All right. Now, he has both these, and he's going to give the other two away, of course. I'm glad that the system works that way, that they actually do give that shit away. Alright, you can disband. And our vassals are unhappy by six, but it's not that bad. And we're back under our county limit, which is good. Duke of Salerno. Good for you. You need to get married, though. Seriously. Well, yeah, why don't you marry, uh... Her. Or her. No. Then... Her. No. Oh, she's too old. There you go. Try to have some babies. Okay, this is a problem. The Duke of Corinthia now also has the Duchy of Benevento. That is definitely a problem. Alright, we are done with the war, all of our troops are gone, and England's calling us into war again, this time, who? Flemish independence, oh, of course we'll join that war. Man, he really likes us. We're not going to help, but uh, there you go. Oh, he's already got it under control, it's 50%. Okay, so I think we have a truce with these guys. Yes, we do. And we have a truce with the Zogmanids for sure. So, our next step should be these clowns. Is it all just one duchy? I guess it is. Holy War for Sicily. Yes, sir. Well, maybe we should let our troops rest a bit. Are there any holy orders we could get? Oh, just that one that we just had. Yeah, we'll, we'll rest a bit and go for Sicily in a little bit. Who does he have as allies anyway? Sultan of Africa. I'm not too worried about him. Actually, we could go to war with that dude. Yeah. Could take that from Benevento, because there's no reason why that place should be there. 
None. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get that out of the way. Let's just use our own troops for this. Let's see what comes. Let's see if anyone joins his side. Yep. The fad lids. It's the people running Sicily. What are these guys doing here? They've been standing in Toronto forever. They start moving to Verona and then they stop. All of them. I don't know what is up with that. Looks like a bug because they've been there forever. The Holy Orders heal up pretty quickly when you leave them alone, when you don't recruit them. So we'll let them get back up before we recruit any of them. Fabricate claim on the Duchy of Capua. And we died. And we lost all those claims we had, but it doesn't show them. Because we had claims on this province and this province. We had four claims that we lost. That sucks. All right, let's go ahead and redo our court. And everyone doesn't like us. Why? We're weak, arbitrary. Yeah, I wouldn't like us either. You'll make do. Wow. You guys really hate us. You talk to the Pope for me. Spymaster better be someone we can trust. Man. You'll do, but I need to give you some money. Make you happy. An honorary title. There you go. Steward. Four. No, we'll take the guy with 23. Man. Really don't want to give this guy. Ah, we'll do it. 50 bucks. Okay, we lost all those claims. That sucks. But we knew she was getting old. We knew she was going to kick the bucket soon. So it's not a super big surprise. Yeah, people are upset. Why are you upset? Short reign, primogeniture, limited crown authority, small field tax, title claim. Yeah, we just have so many bad traits. This guy sucks. Really not happy that we took over as this guy, but at least we have a son with a hair lip. And he doesn't even like us. Because <laughs> we're weak and arbitrary, yeah. There's our queen. She sucks. Let's see if we can divorce her. No. Because Pope doesn't like us. Well, I can't do much about that. I've got my dude trying to help out. Let's go uncover plots. Get me some taxes. Research military tech. And you can go back to fabricating claims again on the same shit. 
that this time hopefully we'll live long enough to actually use them. But we definitely have too much shit. We own these two directly, so let's give those away to some Italians. Steward of Toronto. You're not heir to anything, are you? Nope, you have no parents. Okay, good. Istria is yours, if I could find it. Steward of Genoa. You have no heirs or anything. Perfect. I mean, no family or anything. Carnton, Carnton, Carnton. Bingo. Okay, now we have nine. And that's what our mother had, but we cannot handle nine, so let's give Pavia away. Steward of Cremona. He's an heir. Steward. You're an heir. Steward. No heir. I mean, not an heir. Okay, good. You can have Pavia. Oh, I just gave it away from a marshal, didn't I? Marshal of Capua. No, you're an heir. Court chaplain. You're not an heir to anything. Okay, good. We'll give you Padua. Or Padua, sorry. So currently we have this little corridor of provinces, but it's still too much for us to handle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't want to give any of them away, so we're just going to sit here with seven over six domain, and that's going to have to do. You hate us because, well, because of all that. So we could have a whole lot of revolts right now. That's not good. This guy is going to revolt for sure. Wants to control the county of Istria, the county of Carton. Yeah. Alright, well... It's a good thing we have a lot of money, because we're going to need to hire a whole bunch of mercenaries. In fact, why don't we preemptively get uh, some mercenaries here. Yeah, 4,000. Uh, we'll get some cheaper ones. 3,000. And we'll bring them down here to help out in this war. Really sucks that we took over in the middle of a war. But what are you going to do? Oh, we only have one duchy. We only have one duchy. Oh, that's right, because we got rid of the duchy of Venice. Hmm. I guess we could create the duchy of Lombardy. No, we don't have any provinces in that duchy. Well, we can't create the Duchy of Modena? Why not? Someone has Modena? The King of Georgia has Modena. Why? We own both provinces in Modena. I don't know how the King of Georgia has that. We can do the Duchy of Sardinia as well. I'm not going to worry about that right now. My brother left our court. Because he wants his liege to press claims on us, but his liege is one of our vassals, so it's probably not going to happen. Anyway, let's... Uh, man, this is so bad. Look at all that. Wow. Got a nice crown, though. Damn, that's much better than his mother's crown. Or his uh, grandmother's crown. Hers is so plain. and It's a Burger King crown, be honest. And his has jewels and shit. He's like, yeah. Yeah, it's cause, probably because he's a bad steward. Alright. And he has a claim on Zagreb for some reason, which I don't care about. Yep. 
So Benevento has revolted, and that's going to increase the revolt risk of everyone else. But this is one of the reasons why we only give very, very small amounts of stuff to our vassals. Now, see, here's an interesting, th interesting thing. We are currently at war with these guys to give a uh, bishopric to the Duke of Benevento. So if we win this war, then the Duke of Benevento gains the, this bishopric right here, the Mosque of Ascoli. But this guy just went to war with us. So it seems a little odd that he would do that while we are currently pressing his claim. Oh well. And Cremona. And it's just going to fail Cascade from there. Firenze will be next, and then Toronto. Got a tithe. Tithes are good. Everyone that declares, everyone that, everyone within the kingdom that goes to war with us, so anyone who revolts, is going to encourage other people to revolt because they feel we are weaker. Yep, there's Firenze, and then Cagliari will be next. Oh, can't even make men plots anymore. Crusade for Germany. Really? Wow, whoever wins that is going to be amazingly strong. I'm a little busy right now to crusade for Germany. I don't have any vassal levies raised. Huh, we just happened to be in Firenze when he revolted. So, bye-bye Forensian -bye army. It's too bad we didn't capture the guy. Could have ended that war right away. Actually losing money every month right now. That's amazing. Yeah. And everyone has holy orders raised right now. Or Vieto. What's going on, Pope? Ah, the Crusade for Germany, of course. Who has joined so far? Tuscany, Prussia, Hospitaller, Brittany. Sweden. Sweden's probably going to win. Oh, we need to educate someone. Who's this? Our son! Our heir needs education. Let's find him someone with good stewardship, unlike us. He's Swedish. He's Italian, but he has no diplomacy. German, Italian. Well, you might have to do, even though you suck, Mr. Hunchback. Uh, this guy's the winner. Italian. Alright, we're about to group up our army. Very good. Oops, sorry about that. That must have been pretty noisy. England has peace, so let's invite him to wars. Or oh, we cannot. Notice Marshal Count Bruno's hard work, and everyone seems to like him. Heighten the morale of troops or recruit more soldiers. Morale, of course.
So are these, are these guys going for independence or what? Yep, independence and independence and independence. All right. So be it. Odd. It said food smuggled in, and then a couple days later, fasting. We can imprison the Count of Toronto. Oh, he's excommunicated. I really don't care. Oh, I guess I should have done it, because now he revolted. Whatever. I was thinking that if I do it, then he won't be able to revolt. But I didn't do it, so now he revolted. Oh my goodness, 2,000 defenders. But we're now winning this war. You want peace yet? No. Alright. Let's go ahead and get some more mercs, just so we can quicken this up. Oh man, that's expensive. Uh, plot to kill Prince Pusosa. We'll deal with it. That's cheap. 3,000 mercs. Alright, let's deal with this plot. She wants to kill our only son, so we're not going to let her do that. Alright, mercs, please go... Well, we'll get some morale up. And then we'll go kill these guys. Man, there's so many fucking Muslims just standing in Treviso. What are you doing? Yes, it was misdirected, wasn't it? Too bad we can't call England into our wars right now. But yeah, I bet Sweden's going to win the Crusade. Oh, what's going on up here? Install Brian. Oh, Scotland is having some, some succession crisis. Wales took over some of Northern Ireland again. How's the Holy War going? Yep, Sweden's winning by a lot. So Sweden's going to get more powerful. Good job, them. And Poland has taken over part of Denmark. Interesting. Hungary's got some internal shit going on. Hungarian Holy War for Cherson. Looks like they're not doing too good. Uh, got the Pope to like us more. Can we get a divorce now? No. We'll keep checking. Alright, morale is up. Let's go kill these guys. And then we'll go kill these guys. to Achillea. I guess we can go follow. It's not that far. You guys want peace yet? Mr. Negative 60%? No. Man, they're still trying for Spoleto. They are really going all out in this war. They're back to 0%. Or is that a new one? It might even be a new one. I don't know. Uh... Most illustrious King Benevento, the burghers of Castelliccio, blah, 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 unable to pay their taxes. Well, see, we have no choice now. We don't have a third option because our leader sucks. 
He has no diplomacy, no stewardship, no nothing. He just sucks. So we have to give in to this right here. Minimal city taxes. No option. Well, that and it'll make people a little less upset. So we'll do it anyway. Our wife has typhus. That's not good. We're leading troops in Mantua. Good for us. Wait, how are we leading troops in Mantua? We are somehow here. Leading troops in Mantua. It's odd. King Benvenuto. The Moronic of Italy. Our grandmother was the great. We are the moronic. You're running to Verona and Cremona. I guess we'll take out the one in Cremona. And please don't give me typhus, wife. Oh, man, we're taking a lot of attrition in this siege. But we can't force the issue because they have way too many defenders. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Look at that. Sweden has 90,000 points already. They, they've they've already won that crusade. It's over. I was kind of hoping England would do it, but I don't think England's even getting involved. All right, so let's take care of who's next. Cremona is the next one to revolt. So we need to go to get them. And we've reached half an hour again, so thank you very much for joining me today. This is Shenra from Shenplay signing off. Have a good day, everybody, and join us next time where we'll see if we can survive all these fucking revolts, and we'll see if anyone else revolts. Oh, yeah, the Pope. New Pope. Hello, New Pope. That's a nice mustache you have there, Pope. See you guys later.